Welcome to Dorista. I'm Pino Gree, and this is Flip Sticker. We're at Avatar Museum 3, trying on three avatars today. Let's go! This one is from... Hello, Jingai Chudoku. The avatar's name is Mariana. She is a dice lady with prosthetic arms and the body of a huge terrifying snake and the tongue of a huge terrifying snake as well. How, how bizarre this one is. Uh, but they made it stand out to me. She can lick her own eyeball. She can extend an ex crazy about with it. Uh, but the weirdest animation of this is the transformation. If she's feeling a little too human for you, it uh, don't worry. Oh, here he goes. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's getting worse. It's getting worse. Oh, no. And now we're all in fear for our lives. Oh, no. Look out. Look out. Oh, no. It's got to get the camera, man. Oh! My second pick, I've chosen this little adventure from the studios at Fine Trick. Her name is Mamona, and she has some really cool things to show off. Like, let's say you're sitting at home with your McDonald's, but you left your fries across the room and you can't reach them. Well, worry no more. You have these extendo arms to help you out and grab whatever you want, whether it's a fry, the remote, or if you just want to grab at your friend's face. Everything's fine. What are they going to do? They can't reach you. They don't have extendo arms. Uh, or if you want to make yourself even harder to get to, you could also turn on your booster pack and take flight, which is pretty dang cool. Oh, snap. Look at it. Get the steam activation. And she flies around. Oh, snap. You guys can't see it, but she's flying. Ooh. <laughs> Pretty dope. But it's not just those little boosters that can make you fly. There's something else that you, <laughs> in this avatar you haven't seen yet. Not sure if you can point out what it is. Giant mech suit. Take flight once more. And with this, she could also reach out and extend her arms, but it's with much more control. She also has a targeting system with it. You could also, so you don't, you, you can do more than just pinch at your friend's face. You can uh, target them as well. Uh, wait, what are you doing, Peter? Don't be, don't be shooting at me now. They have these pigeons homing systems that track whatever you're targeting. I think this avatar is really cool if you want to show off your sweet mech skills. It's so complicated and complex. You can just also, yeah, just a punch with it. Oh, okay. But if you have a simpler taste than with a giant robot, uh, there's also one other option which uh, Pino keeps using on us. We can't uh, really stop her from using the flamethrower. It, lo it looks like a fire extinguisher, but it shoots flames. Amazing. Just amazing. Thank you, Fine Trick Studio. <laughs> this was actually really cool. I like this one a lot. One of the cooler mech avatars I've seen. What? What is this? Why am I in this? Well, this was really nice. It, 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 doesn't it look really pretty? It's got a, it's got a boob slider, and you can do the, the, you can look like a oh, succubus. That's it, boys. The customization. Okay, look. All right, look, guys. Look, you don't understand. You have a boob slider. You can do it to change how. Look at this in real time. You can watch them. Isn't that, isn't that great? <laughs> isn't that cool? You can also do, uh, let's see what else you can put on. I can put on uh, wings on me. It's, it's really something else. I'm gonna, uh, I think about how much is this one? This is, this one is from, uh, Puppet End. Her name is Momo. And I think everyone should buy this one. I think, you know, it's really state of the art. Really a uh, game changer. Thinking outside the box. Bravo. Bravo. 
Well, that was great. Avatar Museum 3 is very cool. Way more avatars than I expected there to be. I recommend bringing a guide with you. Pino is very good at it for trying them on, modeling all the different outfits. She won't do the boob sliders for some reason. I don't know why. She's anti-boob slider. Start with Mecca's the sock puppets. She loves sock puppets. What's up, Peter? What did you think, Peter? Did you like those avatars? What did you think of the avatars I chose? Well, it was my pleasure to guide you and the viewers to the Avatar Museum. Um, all of the Japanese modeling community is really something else. And everyone has their own unique taste and speciality. So this museum does a very good job of showcasing it. And I'm already looking forward to Avatar Museum 4. <gasps> Me too. Very cool. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Make sure you like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like it, please give us a comment and subscribe our channel. See you in next video.